Let's keep going. We're going to do a few body parts. So when I call it out, touch that body part. Where's your head? Head, good job. Everybody, just about everybody knows that one. And stop. Where are your shoulders? There you go. Shoulders. They go up and down. Shoulders have another name. We have muscles in our shoulders called deltoids. And stop. Where is your stomach? Stomach. Your stomach has muscles as well. Those are called your abdominals or your abs. Good job. And stop. Where are your knees? Knees. I like to shake my knees. And stop. A muscle that is very close to your knees is your hamstrings. Where are your hamstrings? Ah, good. Hamstrings are the muscles under your legs. See them better this way? These are your hamstrings muscles down here. Stop. Last body part. Where are your toes? There they are. How many do you have? I hope you said 10. If not, you're missing some. Tap your toes. And stop. Very good. We're going to do our push-ups and sit-ups next. So let's get ready. We'll do our push-ups first. So let's get in push-up position. When you do your push-ups, remember, hands, knees, and toes. We're going to do eight today. I'll show you four regular push-ups. Try and keep up. If not, that's okay. And then I'll show you four modified push-ups if you need a little extra help. One foot back, two feet back. Down, up, one. Down, up, two. Down, up, three. Down, up, four. Good job. If you can't do them as fast again, not a problem. You can push pause and get your eight push-ups. For our modified, scoot your hands out a little bit because you're going to roll forward when you get on your knees. Cross your ankles, your feet behind you. Down, up, one. Down, up, two. Down, up, three. And down, up, four. And stop. Great job with your push-ups. Those are not easy. So thanks for working hard. Last, we're going to do our sit-ups. We're also going to do eight sit-ups. Lay down, feet are flat on the ground, knees are up in the air. Remember, hands on the shoulders, hands assisting you, holding on to a, a friend, a family member. If you really need to, you can grab onto your legs. Up, down, one, up, down, two, up, down, three, down four, up, down five, up, down six, grab a hold of somebody, up, down seven and pull, or use your legs, up, and that's eight. Very good. It's starting to get a little warm out here. That means you're working hard. We're going to move on, balancing, hopping, and jumping your necks. You got to stand up for these. To balance, arms out straight, one foot up, one, two, three, four, five, and foot down. Switch to your other leg, arms out, foot up. One, two, three, four, five, foot down. Back to the one we started with. Arms out, foot up. One, 
two, three, four, five. We'll put down. Last balance. We'll use this leg. Arms out. Put up. One, two, three, four, five. Put down. Next up, hopping. Very similar. Starting off with our arms out, one foot up, and swing and hop. One, two, three, and down. Now to this leg, arms out, foot up, swing it, one, two, three, and down. Moving on, because we still got to get to our ball, we're going to move on to jumping. We're going to bend our knees, put our arms back, swing our arms and jump. Good job, back up, bend those knees again. Arms are back, swing them up, and jump. Great. One more jump. Bend those knees. Arms are back, swing them up, and jump. Great job, everybody. Now's the time to get your ball. Go ahead and grab it. Go grab somebody if you need help who's going to be your partner. Remember, you can also... If your parents say it's okay, toss it to a couch or a chair. I'll give you a second, hit pause, go get what you need or who you need and come right back. You're back? Great. Got the ball? We're going to be tossing. I'm going to show you how it looks one way so you can see everything, then I'm going to turn back and face the camera so that I have a target that I can toss to. So hopefully the ball will come back to me. I don't have any help. When we toss a ball, you're going to hold it in your dominant hand. You're going to step with your opposite. Ball's in my right hand. Stepping with my left. I'm going to lean over. I'm going to swing the ball back behind me. Not way up high. Just back a little bit. Right behind my body. See how it goes right back here? Then I'm going to toss, extend my arm, toss the ball. Again, ball in the hand, I'm going to step with my opposite, bring the ball back, and toss. I want my hand to point towards my target where it's going to end up. Now I'm going to turn and face you, and I hope this works with the wall I'm tossing in. So we're going to toss four times. Actually five. Let's toss five. Hold the ball. I'm going to step with my opposite. I'm going to swing my arm back and toss it at my target. Came back to me. Did it come back to you if it's bouncing back? Or did your partner catch it? Good job. Let's do it again. Ball in your hand. Step with your opposite foot. Swing it back and toss it. That's two. We've got two more. Ball in your hand. Step with your opposite. Swing it back and toss it. Excellent. Last one. Get ready. Ball in your hand. Step with your opposite foot. Swing it back and toss it. Oh. That ricocheted twice on me. Good job. If I'm going too fast, as always, hit the pause button, practice, come back to me. You can do that at any time if we're going too fast. You need to stop and take a break or move on and do something else. Come back when you have opportunity. Good job with tossing, everybody. We are just about done. I want to go over it. What we've talked about today, got to find the camera here. Today, we talked about a new skill, which was tossing. When you toss using a small ball, you are going to put it in your dominant hand. This is the hand that you write with. You're going to step with your opposite foot. Then you're going to swing it back and toss it. Nice and easy to your target. 
We also did all of our normal stretches. We did our uh, muscular strengthening activities with our push-ups and sit-ups. And we did some balancing, hopping, and jumping. I hope y'all had a good time. Oh, and before I forget, we talked about who won the World Series. Go Nats, World Series champions. You can call them Walgreens if you want, but it's a shame that a drugstore beat you. Y'all have a great day. We'll see you again next time. Bye-bye, APE.